Good morning, people. This is your uh, early morning DJ, Mr. Freddie Fun. I am here with Kakaron. It is a sunny day. We out here in Los Angeles, California. We doing great things. Hi, Catherine. Let's see what you got going on today. What you got going on today? I'm hanging out with Mr. Dale Gregg today. Oh, who is Dale Gregg? You know what I'm saying? He must be a nice, enticing type of guy. I don't know about all that enticing. He didn't give me no dick this morning, as he promised. Ooh, he's in trouble. He's in trouble. You know, you got to take care of home sometime. Especially and, when you're going to be gone for over a week. Oh, well, you know, that is things that men should always recognize. When a woman is in need, you know, I'm sure they should take care of their woman. What you think? Absolutely. Because when he falls short, you know what that leaves room for. Well, he got a short dick or what? Well, I don't understand what you're saying. He's got, uh, what do you mean he falls short? It means if he's not taking care of home, that leaves room for what? Oh, well, that leaves room for the mechanic, the maintenance man, or the hairdresser. You never know. You can go any way, you know, these days, you know. So what's going on? In the world today, we got a lot of stuff going on, people fighting and all that kind of stuff, and President Trump and all this kind of stuff, but we're not going to talk about Trump today. He's getting a lot of press, so I won't give him no press today. So what's going on with relationships today? What do you think? They're falling short. However, on the contrary to them falling short, they are falling short. However, there is sort of kind of an uprise on them because they are starting to have plenty of stories and little uh, relationship shows that are strengthening the couples, the relationships. Okay. So you think uh, couples are bonding together and... Um uh, what about marriages? I mean, we need to look that up. The statistics on marriages, are they lasting long these days? Or are they still in, like, you know, a few months, a month, a year? Because, you know, back in the day, they used to last, like, you know, saying 30, 40, 50 years to death do us part for real. What about today? What do you think? Well, there are people that are um, beating the statistics by trying to stay together. Um, a lot of people are believing and waiting to have sex and sometimes it does waiting to have sex before marriage therefore it does kind of strengthen the bond um, but I'm not going to get into that part of it but I do believe that um, the 30 and 40 years there are some marriages that are um, lasting that long throughout the duration they are sticking true to staying together through better and worse wow that's amazing because, you know, like I uh, say about 10 years ago, they had like marriages that wouldn't last a long time. And, you know, marriages, you know, people be married for two, three months and shit. Sometimes they just be married overnight. They woke up and say, did we do that? Shit, are we going to annul that right now? You know, let's get over that right now. So it's a lot of things that's going on in the world. Uh, you know, you got to stay close to the man upstairs, you know, stand safe, stay prayed up, uh, you know, just make sure that, you know, you do the things you need to do. This is Freddie Fun, and this is one of our podcasts, and we'll be right back after these messages.